In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to format your branches in iMind Map 7. To do this, you just have to select the branch, which brings up the branch target, select the grey segment, and this brings up the branch editor with a range of options. In the Format tab, you can select Convert to change your branch from a box branch to a branch, and vice versa. You can also align the text easily along the branch. By clicking the button, you'll see that the text is moving along the branch. You can change the colour of the branch from the menu available or select more colours. And the change applies automatically. Finally, you can edit the shape of the branch by dragging the cursor along the bar so it appears more linear or curved. To format relationship branches, click on the branch and a blue settings cog appears. If you click this cog, it brings up a pop-up menu. Here you'll be able to change the shape, the relationship style, the colour and the width from the drop-down menus available. These changes also happen automatically. With relationship branches, you also have the option to include arrows at either end of the relationship. You can choose these from the drop-down menus. Once you're happy with your options, just click OK and these are applied fully. To format box branches, you can click on the branch, bring up the branch editor once more, and you can change the colour of the branch, change the shape of the branch so it appears more linear, but also you'll notice that there are two tabs beneath the box branch itself. The left hand tab brings up a range of colours which change the fill and the branch itself. The right hand tab brings up a range of box shapes for you to apply, as so.